Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Close Combat, Wacht am Rhein. Alright, so we managed to keep the armored Germans off our backs for a while. <laughs> I guess that's pretty good. Um, and we are about to um, engage the Kampfgruppe Piper once again. We do have a small uh, gap here in the middle. Uh, let's see, where is it? Here it is where there's sort of a, a, a movement in the German lines um, though the good thing is with that that we can probably move troops down here to this area and stop them and they'll be faced with blockage from a couple of sides um, although they could move into this air foresty area I suppose I don't know they are mobile and we also have other troops coming in from the area over here um, 82nd Airborne is coming. Gonna keep them on the roadblocks as far as we can, and we may have to move the 30th Infantry Division here. Uh, <coughs> but, well, that's uh, with our next strategic move. So, I left a little gap there. I'm not sure why I did that, but uh, they're bound to exploit it, the Germans. Alright, let's see. We've got uh, Sherman, 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 Sherman. Uh, Hellcats, uh, 105 millimeter Sherman versus Panthers of the Panzer Leer, I think. No, Kampfgruppe Piper first SS. Uh, that's even worse. Okay, those guys are not gonna back off. They're gonna keep coming. So, all right, the battle continues. Oh, we were already fighting here. That is true, we were. Um, however, the good news is. And this is really good news that they may have taken our bridge, but they have not yet <laughs> penetrated down our line here. And they're not going to. I'm going to make sure that um, I get this forest trail back. I hope. And I'm going to use some serious artillery fire to uh, suppress them, or at least that's the uh, the plan. There we go. Okay, so the 150 millimeters Sherman. I guess we're gonna defend this open area here with just tanks and uh, for sort of force them down this funnel here. If they want to keep this bridge, they're gonna have to defend it. <coughs> um, that's uh, that's basically our uh, our plan. Um, the best way to defend it, I guess, is from this field. So let's have a look. Um, for some reason, they it's divided all my Shermans over the all the other groups. I don't like that. Why did you do that game? There was no reason. Oh well, we'll keep you with the 30 cal on there and that's, that's fine. It's actually a pretty good idea. <coughs> Alright, so that's a 105 millimeter Sherman right there, which I guess we can move. Just keep it there on the fence. And 76 Millimeter Sherman, that's gonna be on the fence over here. On the fence. I have no idea if this is going to work. I have to find out. And then we have the Hellcat, which we will move down here on the fence, like that. And what can you see? You, know, you could pretty much strike at everything across the bridge but not on the bridge. I don't like that. So I want you to be able to hit whatever's coming down the bridge. Okay, now you can. Nope, just not down this road. Okay. Okay, whatever. Holy shit, if they put a tank here, they can hit this thing. Don't like that. What about now? No, no, no. Yes, that's no, it's actually a very bad spot to put that Hellcat. Don't put it back here. Can we aim down the road somewhat? Down the field, but not down the road. Um, but he can't actually see me here, so that's excellent. Don't mind that. Man, this is a horrible position. Maybe we should put it on the other end here. Just next to the building or something? I don't know. We won't be able to penetrate anything um, coming down the bridge. I already know that. Uh, I mean, as in, 
um, from uh, fr penetrate the front of whatever is coming. Um, so that's a that's a bit of a shame. Unless we sort of make it stand like that. There we go. Yeah, they're gonna try and use the bridge. They're gonna be sorry they did. <laughs> and then there's a platoon leader who is going to be defending this area like this. So they only have this bridge as a possible point to cross. So five units to defend that is is pretty neat. I like that. We'll do that. That's how we'll do this. Um, okay, this is what units? Oh, that one. Okay, so that's a top group. Cool. Um, hmm. Top group. Top group. Oh no, man. It's like a bad idea to put them there. I guess the top group will be the front group. <laughs> wow, am I going to be sorry I did that, but okay. There we go. It'll be aiming down this road towards the forest trail. It's going to be covering the infantry. Yes, the infantry, that's right. There's going to be infantry moving up onto this flagged area here. An ambush, anyone gets near that gets shot. More of them. We're going to regain some of this lost ground, if you will. On ambush, there we go. <coughs> All right. And then we have a platoon leader who are now over there. You're not supposed to be over there. You're supposed to be like down here. Leading. <laughs> An ambush. There we go. So the only thing that fires is the tank initially. The reason for that. I don't want to expose my infantry instantly. And then, and then we need to get this middle group here. Oh wait, we still have the mortar carrier. That is true. Just put that one uh, on the road here. On ambush. Is, is it in any way possible to see down the road? No, it's not. Good. We can, we can move him in whenever we need him. <coughs> right, so the last group, I guess, is going to make a dash for the bridge. At least capture that. Um, I guess we'll put the mortar team in this trench here. And not gonna be an, a, a super effective uh, force. Um, but the mad dash for the bridge force is definitely. They're gonna try. <laughs> there we go. Put them on the fence. Oh, not like that. Actually, it's not that bad if you do it this way. Because then you have the side sort of side armor aiming at the enemy but um, I guess I'm gonna put this one a little bit behind the other one so sort of fueling it there we go and there's our Sherman, our last Sherman on the fence there like that maybe even like that maybe even like this <laughs> yeah Oh, that's too close together. We want to spread them a little bit. That'll work. Okay. Alright, so that's that. Um, and we've got an engineer team as well. We're obviously going to be close by on this little hill here on ambush. As close to the en enemy as possible. Okay, so uh, hopefully this will work. If not, it's going to be a very, very short battle indeed. We have artillery support, so I have good hopes. Oh, hello. <laughs> that one got instantly hammered. Stop bailing out. That one is gone. But it doesn't matter, because we can do this.
Is that thing gone? I think it, feet, yeah, I think we might have hit it. So that's cool. Okay, good. Oh, not good. Definitely not good. Okay, we lost another one. We lost a shot. Bethel's Panther is burning. I guess we got the Commander's Panther? Yes, we did, with all that cannon fire. They've offered a ceasefire. Well, no. <laughs> How about let's not do that? Huh? Oh god, these things have also been hammered. It's unfortunate. Um, okay, there's nobody here. You can cease firing. Go back on ambush. Go on. So we've lost a great deal of armor, actually. That's unfortunate. Oh, these! Oh, wow! They were already, already destroyed as well? Good grief. Oh, hello. Are you going to pop out? You are, aren't you? Yeah, you're afraid. I know you are. Yeah, he's gonna move. Don't, don't panic. Come on, fire! Yes! Awesome! Oh, really? Ah, well. Wow! Uh, okay, minor German victory, but we're still there. Uh, the battle ended because both sides were exhausted for some reason. Mm. We got that Befils Panther, though. So that's pretty nifty. Whoa, actually... Wow, they retreated? We're not. No, wait, they didn't. No, I'm bullshitting. They're still here. They're just down on their luck because they're out of running out of vehicles quickly. So that's pretty good. That is excellent, in fact. All right. So, Tail Camp versus the 99th Infantry Division. Super. Um. All right. I think we can handle that. Somewhat. Hmm. They did have artillery support for a reason. Um, we have one fifty-seven millimeter AT gun and a couple of bazooka guys. This ought to be fun. Battle continues. Oh wow, we are actually doing that, were we? We are already fighting them here in this town. Ah, five ways and about. 20 ways to die. Alright, so we need that 5 ways point. That's gonna be our bottom team's uh, effort. There we go. There's I think I see a house there where I can put my my guy. Yeah, that's right. Go on the fence instantly. If there's a tank there, you're gonna fa fucking zap it. Instantly. There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's great. That's fantastic. Go for it. All right. Um, what about your others? Uh, Thirty caliber machine gun. Obviously, we need that for some good old fire support. Let's see where we're we gonna put them in this house over here, aiming at and then defending basically up here like that. Just aiming at the crossroads there. Rifle team. Rifle team is ah, this is the rifle team. Okay, cool. Let's have a look. Um, clearly we need some guys in the other buildings as well. Um, but we need you guys to be sort of defending, I guess. Can you be defending down this road? No, you're actually just... Okay, you're getting that part done. Okay, that's, that's fine. BAR team. BAR, the Browning Automatic Rifle. Staple gun of many a soldier. BAR team is going to be striking them from this wooded area here. Can they see it in any? No, they can't. Okay, so it's not the best spot to put them. Damn it! 
kind of hoped that it was this, this would be a good spot can we put him behind this building we can oh oh <laughs> we're gonna create a little bit of trouble here for them yeah they're gonna be moving I'm gonna sneak them up to this corner here where they can see all of the neighborhood there we go and then we have a mortar team that's gonna support them oh oh dear oh my god where are you ah here we go and we'll put those guys I guess in this little dell here on ambush like that there we go okay so that's team number one team number two is the middle team middle team with a 57 millimeter gun which will be aiming down a road I suppose it's gonna be this road or the other one that is actually a very crucial question I'm gonna be right on top of the enemy if you put it there Okay, open. Um, guessing we could put it over here, sort of in cover or half in cover, defending to the north there. Can I put it in a house? No. Can we put it in a building? We can. And we put it in a building. There we go. Screw you, AI. But just put it in a building. <laughs> And we can just just about hit the uh, the area there. So hopefully, if they move tanks across this line, we'll be able to shoot them. There we go. Super awesome. BAR team. Um, you're gonna be fighting the mayor's house. There we go. That's gonna be your task. Uh, apparently I put another bazooka team in there. We need zookas up here as well. I'm sort of expecting them to put armor in this area. <coughs> for some reason. I don't know. <laughs> um, if they do, I, I better be ready for them. If they come down the road, we're fucked. So we don't want that. Uh, rifle team. Rifle team, um, probably best in this two-story building over here and uh, not on ambush actually on the fence crinkles 30 caliber machine gun uh, do we have any high-rising buildings here anything except for the church no it's just a church well we'll put him in a bell tower and have them on the fence there pretty much cover the entire section there and then we have I think the platoon leader that belongs with them it's this one and um, whom we will put in this building over here there we go okay now the top team the top team will have the horrible task of taking back this point I say horrible because I expect them to suffer pretty hefty casualties I'm not even sure if I'm gonna make it but we're gonna try no oh, that's that's a clusterfuck if I ever saw one uh, yeah we'll just put you guys down here sneak down here sort of through these trees and then into this building there you go. 50 caliber heavy machine gun. That's actually pretty useful against vehicles and such. So, what if we put you... We can't. But what about the... Oh, that other building. We are, we do actually own that other building there on that corner. <coughs> this one is partially ours. There we go. So, we'll put these guys on ambush. Like so. I want you to look down the roads. Which you now can. Great. Even better, you're going to draw fire. You are going to draw fire. And then there's another platoon leader. Did I put two officers in there? Apparently I did. Okay. Hm. Go figure. I didn't know that. Huh. 
Um, there's a little bit of a gap there. I don't want gaps. I hate gaps. So you're gonna, you guys are going to be out of your guard. There we go. Or rather, no. Rather, you're going to be supporting the assault on the mayor's house. There. Okay, that's it. Hopefully, we won't get blown away instantly. There we go. I know where to aim now. Thank you. Did you get it yet? Ah, yes, we got it. Got a lot of vehicles there building already. Yep, they're already getting killed. That's awesome. What about our cannon? It's still up. Wow, our cannon is still up. That's nifty. Oh, that those got killed. That's unfortunate. Ah, ammunition going up. That's wonderful news. Okay, well, maybe we should offer them ceasefire now. We're under heavy fire! Hit the dirt! Go, run, run, get him! Yeah, we're going to offer them to see if they take it. And they do. Okay, we won the battle because we uh, control a greater number of crucial victory locations. Let's look at the details because we didn't actually lose any vehicles. Yay! And barely any infantry, but the Germans lost almost half their force. So, good news for us. Well done, I'd say. Let's look at how strong they actually were. Can we somehow see that? Is there an option to see that? Is it the 902nd we were fighting? I don't remember. If only I could remember. <laughs> no. Uh, okay. Let's see. No stealth comp we were fighting. Ah, yeah. They're pretty much down to their last reserves. Alright, so the next battle will be... Let's see. Um, the next battle will be... Up here, Von Boom. And his... Um, Jolly Panther Force. And we didn't actually give these guys supporting fire. Holy crap. Not very smart. I should have. <laughs> ah. Well. If we don't make it, we don't make it. It's that simple. Anyway. That'll be it for this uh, episode. Thank you all for joining me. And see you all soon. Bye bye.